everyone and welcome back to the vlog we are in toronto right now we had to wake up at 3 a.m so then we went to the airport in new york and it was actually chaotic there was something oh a squirrel oh my gosh Anyways, it was actually so stressful and chaotic at the airport because there was something happening at the security and it was just not moving for like an hour and everyone was missing their flights and we were like on time so we made it. We didn't really have any time left to eat something so we were really hungry. We did make it and that's the most important part. So then we got here at like 10 and we went to the airbnb to leave our baggage because the check-in was at four but we were so tired and we just wanted to settle in and then go do something but the check-in was really late so we went to wendy's um for food and we just literally sat there for like Two hours and then i was like you know i can just text the airbnb host again to see if there's any possibility of checking in early so i texted him and then we were able to come in at like two which was amazing so we are in the airbnb right now it's actually a much nicer airbnb than the one in new york um it is a very sketchy area which is kind of scary but for the money this is like good and we have a private bathroom now which we didn't have in new york and it was so cute because the host left two bottles of water and little chocolates with a note and i took a picture that was so cute so he just napped for like two hours i just woke up so i'm gonna freshen up a little like do my makeup and yop is taking a shower right now and then we're gonna go to an all you can eat sushi restaurant that i found on tiktok so i'm very excited to eat sushi <laughs> Good morning. We had a very chill morning. We actually slept in a little and now it's like already 11 a.m. or something. Plan for today is probably go to Kensington Market. Then we're gonna meet up with Yvette, which is a friend who I met through Twitter a couple of years ago. And now we saw each other once, but we saw each other in Toronto four years ago. So we're gonna meet up with her later and grab coffee. After that, we're going to this brewery, which is called Amsterdam Brew House, I think which is obviously very niche for us. Fun day in Toronto! Woohoo! <laughs> Woo! We just met up with Yvette, which was really fun. It was really nice to just see her again after four years. But basically all we've done today is just get food and coffee everywhere and my stomach is kind of hurting because of all the coffee so we're just gonna head to the Kensington market now and then the park and then after that the brewery Sure, man. Yeah. If things 
so hard to say But I've been here before And I surrender up my heart And swap it for yours now I'm out of touch, I'm out of love I'll pick you up when you're getting down And out of all these things I've done I think I love you better now I'm out of sight, I'm out of mind I'll do it all If we can sing one of yours, would you like one of Thing to show up before we We will Long story short, I went to Toronto four years ago to see Sean play his first ever stadium show. It was fun, you know, it was fun. Now we went to Toronto and obviously it did bring up like some memories, but I have not seen Sean in four years and I didn't think I would be seeing him. So we did look at maybe if we wanted to go to a concert here because Ed Sheeran was playing. We were like, oh, Ed Sheeran, that's so fun. But the tickets were so expensive. So we were like, okay, you know, never mind. We can still see. We went to the park earlier today and we got off the tram and I got a text. And she was like, Sean Mendes just sound checked with Ed Sheeran. And all of our plans dropped for today and we <laughs> went to Ed Sheeran. But honestly, Ed Sheeran was so, so fun. He played Lego House and I knew Sean would come on because um, he shouted tech it with Sean. And Sean did a cover of that like 100,000 years ago. Honestly, I did not think I would be seeing him in like years. I also haven't seen him in years, but I didn't think I would like see him in a couple of years. And then it's in the stadium that I saw him play his first stadium in with y'all. So now we're gonna go back to the Airbnb and sleep. And then the plans we had for today, like to go to the brewery, um, we're gonna do that tomorrow because we still really want to go to the brewery, but you know, priorities. Good night. Bye bye. Slap lekker. Slap lekker. Good morning. We slept in again. Also to just feel all of the emotions from yesterday. So now we're going to Tim Hortons because that's obviously like the Canadian thing. So we're gonna get breakfast and coffee there. And then the rest of the plan for today is to go to the distillery district and then have lunch at the George Street Diner, which is the diner that Sean filmed his first video clip at, which is very cute. So those emotions will probably also be hitting hard today. I took a photo there four years ago, so I wanna recreate that photo. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do and then go to the brewery and tonight we're gonna go to Toronto Island
Kyoto Island um, right now. What we did today was literally just get food everywhere, walk around a lot, have a lot of drinks. So yeah, now we're on Toronto Island doing the sunset to get rid of see anything. But view is very nice and now we're probably just gonna have dinner somewhere here. Just enjoy our last night because tomorrow we're going back to New York. And then we're flying back to Amsterdam, which is very sad. Sad times. Today is our last day, which is very sad. We just got some coffee and well, I was gonna take you up to this brunch place that I thought was very cute. And it, my name was like the name of the restaurant. And it looks very cute and the food looked very good, but uh, I just saw that it's closed on Monday. So we can't go there. Now we're gonna go to Tim Hortons again because the food there was also really good. We don't have much on the planning today. We're gonna do a little bit of shopping, but we walked past this store this morning and we accidentally already both bought something that does not fit in the suitcase, but fine. So we're gonna go to the Toronto sign, like the letter, because we haven't seen that. And then probably go to Dundas Square and the like shopping mall there. Do a little bit of shopping, have some food and coffee for the last time, and then take the bus to New York. got to the bus station we have like three hours left but um we just went to sephora here because i really wanted to get a rare beauty blush but it was sold out at the other uh, places so we just went to this one so now we're having mcdonald's and then we're gonna board the bus but i'm just gonna end the vlog here because we'll literally be on a bus for 10 hours which is not that interesting and then when we get to new york we're just gonna get coffee and go to shake shack probably for food because that food's just too good and then board the plane to Amsterdam. So thank you for watching. Subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you next time.